I wasn't about to turn down a 1976 Japanese film entitled Machine Gun Dragon, was I? Certainly not. If you think this film sounds rather awesome, as I had, you'll be very glad to know that this film is, in fact, incredibly cool. Familiar 70s Yakuza star Bunda Sugawara stars as Ryuta Yabuki, our titular machine gun dragon. Yabuki is said to possess one of the only machine guns in Japan, and thereby is one of the few to have mastered its deadly efficiency. Yabuki commits robberies against gangsters, with his devoted mother in tow, hangs out with some rambunctious bikers, and spends time with his fashionably astute girlfriend. The Yakuza do not at all appreciate the thefts, and so they conspire to slay the machine gun dragon and all those that he holds dear. This film has a very animated flavour. It seems as though it might be a manga adaptation, though to the best of my knowledge it is not. For what it is worth, it sports a stronger screenplay than expected. Ibuki's relationship with his mother is fascinating, and the cartoonish caricatured evil of the gangster antagonist is rather creative, again suggesting a comic book aesthetic. Its director, Akahisa Okamoto, appears to have made his debut with Machine Gun Dragon, and made very few films afterward, none of which I have seen. So I had a wonderful time viewing Machine Gun Dragon. If you are inclined toward its title, premise, and era, you will probably have a most fun time with it.